Hello again everyone, we are Gaming by Gaslight and welcome to Airships Conquer the Skies, a steampunk airship building game that just came out of early access. And, well, let's actually just jump right on in. Let's start with the tutorial, get a feel for things. We won't do all the tutorial stuff on camera, we'll do a couple and then we'll jump into the awesomeness of destroying enemy ships. Good morning, cadet. Glad to see you could join us. I am Commodore Schwartzkolm and I am to be your instructor. Over the next few lessons, I will teach you what you need to know about airships, how they operate, how to command them, their strengths and weaknesses. Shall we begin? The ship you see below you will be your first command, the HMS Lion. Some basic information on how to navigate. You can move around using the arrow and the WASD keys. You can zoom in out with the scroll reel and plus buttons. Gotcha. All right, what do we got? Your ship is composed of rectangular modules. The currently highlighted module is a suspendium chamber. The suspendium crystal inside it generates lift for your ship, keeping it in the air. The chamber can be adjusted, allowing your ship to move up and down. The effect of suspendium weakens at higher altitudes, which means your ship can only reach a certain maximum altitude. It's service ceiling. The propeller module produces propulsion for your ship, allowing it to move back and forth. Both suspendium chambers and propellers require coal to function. This is stored here. Crew members automatically carry the coal to the modules that need it. Of course, the, HS uh, the HMS Lion wouldn't be much of a warship without some weapons. These free cannons at the front of the ship will automatically fire at any ship inside their firing arc. Ammunition is stored here. Again, your crew automatically takes care of reloading weapons. As a commander, your duty is to give high-level orders and position your ship effectively. These crew quarters house the crew. You can see in the info panel at the top left how many air sailors the ship needs and has. Which we can see, yeah, right there. Crew of two, recommended crew, or twelve. Recommended crew of fifteen, so we technically need a few more guys in order to fill this up, huh? This hatch is used to supply the ship with material. Depending on its size, a ship may need one or more hatches or cargo doors. Finally, this is the bridge from which the HMS Lion is controlled. If the bridge is destroyed or left without crew, you will be unable to issue commands to the ship, but it will keep fighting. This quick tour of your ship complete, it is time for a simple combat situation. Alright, let's give it a go. Let's see, it can be seen at the left, and below and to the right is a small building full of Separatists. The ship is already in position for its guns to fire, and vastly outmatches its opponent, so this should be an easy fight. You may simply watch. Oh my. All right, so we see our little guys here. They're going for their ammo. Cannons are cannoning. These guys are doing pretty much. Oh my. Excellent. We have smashed the Separatist outpost. Let's continue to the next part of your training. All right, your next command is the HMS Bear. To improve the ship's survivability, the Bear has a fire point. Two massive tanks of water used by the crew to fight any fires that spring up during combat. That does sound very useful. Currently, the HMS Bear is unarmed. To complete this part of your training, install one or several cannons. All right, click on the cannon in the panel to the left of the glide. Okay, I, I, I don't think I need to read that. I should be able to figure that out on my own. I would like to think, anyway. And... Actually, you know what? Let's actually read. Let's see. Cannon needs to be connected to the ship and have free space in front of it. Ghostly floors extend from the ship where modules can be connected. You see, I feel this is not the most efficient design, because this is the ammo right here. You'd figure you'd want your ammo next to the guns, but then again, that's not necessarily true, is it? You might want, like, a bit of space. The, the ammo should be somewhere, like, well away from the expected firing line. Anyway. We're gonna want to, uh, place a couple of these bad boys. Place all the cannons! Because, you know, you can never have enough DACA. True story. Alright, let, let's go with that. I mean, four cannons should be enough, probably. Let's see, the HMS Bear has discovered a never small separate outpost. Right now, the enemy building is not within the firing arc of the guns because it's too far up. Move the ship down. Select the move command from the command panel below. An outline of your ship will appear at your cursor. Click to move the ship to the location. Okay, so we can just hit M. And we'll, uh, slide on over here. Beautiful. Their puny forces are no match for ours. Press the attack! 
Well, that went well. I pity the fool. Alright, next we will learn how to position your ship to avoid enemy fire. This is the HMS Leopard, your command for this exit. You know what? It looks like we're probably going through all of the tutorials after all. Or not. You know what? We'll, uh... I'm gonna skip through the rest of these so I learn the controls, and then we're gonna go have some fun building ships and blowing stuff up. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, well now we're fighting something a little, uh, a little more exciting. Or we're, we're using a little Land Rover, which apparently can't really move that well. Also, I, yeah, I put a bunch of forward targets on this thing, but we're actually fighting some nasty Raider thing also. Oh, you know what, I forgot to recolor this right here. That was a mistake on my part. Look at that little guy over there in the background. All right, come on, let's let's blow them up. It would be very nice. Blow them up. This fella, he's he's a. I should have put a flat cannon on this, honestly. Yeah, flat cannon would have been much better. Double flat cannon, maybe. I mean, we could try that, I guess. Oh no, wait, he's on fire. So I think we've got a good thing going here. I mean, he's got like a little rifle that's... Like, what's a rifle gonna do against us? A massive... Oh, oh, he's going down. Or, or wait, never mind. Let's flip this. There we go. Oh god, here he comes. Oh, the humanity. Let's, uh, let's roll back a little. Get some more fire in on this thing. Someone's bleeding over there, that's less good. Ah, oh, goody. Alright, so now we've built our first ship. I mean, we're technically still in tutorial land, but alright, so our, our goal of this mission is to just board the enemy ship. That's gonna be pretty cool, I think. Alright, let's see. First, select the board tool and click on the enemy's ship. Once your ship is ready, move it very close. Okay. Board ship, and once, uh, all right. Hull's already been breached, that's wonderful. All right, let's, let's, let's fly over the cannons. There we go, look at that. Launching those marines in there and getting the, fighting the good fight. Excellent, excellent. Ooh, and we got an achievement. You have successfully captured the enemy's ship. Captured ships can fight for your side if you have enough marines to man the guns. I like the sound of that, actually. Alright, final test. A large enemy warship awaits you and you must construct a ship to defeat it. Budget of 2,000 ducats and more modules have been enabled for us to use. Alright, I'm gonna minimize basic so that we can, uh, kinda like go over things. Alright, so we've got the bridge. All right, let's get this show on the road. All right, once you defeat this opponent, you'll prove yourself ready to design all kinds of ships. Oh dear, this guy's. Uh, please tell me his his height is not like considerably superior to mine. It is considerably superior to mine. Wonderful. Great. So we got to shoot him down a little bit here. Oh dear. All right. All right, at least we are smart enough to know how to turn around. All right, let's keep moving out of- oh god, he's so much faster than us. Oh, I'm so heavy. oh god, no, don't do it! Yes, good, we, we have survived. Okay, just keep moving. We can blow his- blow his buttocks out and then we'll be good. Yeah. Yeah, suck it, air blimp. Oh god, we're at- we're as far as we can go. Alright. We're gonna have to go back into the fire- oh wait, he's actually stupidly for some reason moving. Oh, he flipped around. That was your big mistake, buddy! Alright. Yeah, as long as- oh god. Maybe I should tell the marines to cancel. I mean, it does look like it's... Alright, it's, it's, it's dropping a little bit. Alright, 
Alright, let's just keep moving backwards. I mean, we've taken out some of his guns, so that's, that's a plus. Uh, in the future, clearly, clearly I need to be able to fly higher. There we go. Oh, the humanity! I mean, I might, I might have to, I might have to, you know, face fire here. I focused too much on building a bunch of guns and not on, not on really being able to hit this guy. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Oh! Oh, the f Oh, yes. Though, you know, I don't recall seeing access to these, like, floaty things. That would have made life easier. I mean, this thing's gotta be, like, burning. Right? Okay, it's, it's descending a little bit. Okay. We'll move all the way to the- oh yeah, here it comes, here it comes. I'm not gonna be able to board this, though. I gotta save the- oh god! Oh! Oh god, no! Oh lord. Why? Oh, oh why lo oh, 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 look at that! Look at that, the boarding party's coming in to save the day. They're gonna take over the ship from here. Oh god, we're running low on ammo, apparently. Oh god, we're out of bullets. Alright, the boarding team... <laughs> the boarding team is what's gonna save this. I should've put more ammo under this, honestly. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yes, we're taking o Please stop shooting at the other ship while our guys are busy taking it over. Got guys, guys. Yay, we've taken control of the ship. Huzzah, huzzah. Oh, here come some more Marines. Congratulations, you have passed the Airship Academy and are now ready to create and command aerial warships. Let's, uh, let's save our design. Uh, we'll call this the HMS Gaslight Mark I. There we go. All right, I like that. Good. Ooh, t-shirts. Printing gold on t-shirts is kind of hard, but the airship's logo is gold on black. Nice. Anyway. All right, so we, we've done that. And I guess we could do a... We have time for missions, I think. A meeting of scouts. Two scout ships meet. The enemy one is faster and more advanced, but yours has certain advantages too. All right, I like the sound of that. Oh Lord. All right. Oh my god. It, oh, there is a pause button. All right, let's figure out... I can ram it? Ground the ship. Target ship. Focus on shooting. Okay, there's a lot of stuff here. Let's ram it. I mean, that'd be pretty boss-like, says I. Oh, we're going down! This did not go well. Okay, flip, flip the ship, flip the ship, my goodness. Flip the ship. Oh dear. Oh, the humanity! Well, that didn't, that didn't go well. Uh, where's the restart button on this? Let's try that one again. What are my advantages exactly? Because I can't exactly see what we've got going for us here. I mean, we've, we have some guns. Maybe I should have told it to flip first. Alright. I mean, we've got, like, some little guns here. The training academy did not prepare me for this. Um, can we ram it? It's not not going to happen, is it? Oh, 
Oh, wait, I'm, I'm trying to figure out the day. Okay, so it's just like a couple of, uh, oh, hello. We just have a couple of rifles. Gotta, I've gotta be honest, I, I don't, I don't understand what's happening to my poor ship here. Let, you know what, let, let's leave that. Certain advent, all right. Okay, can I, uh, can I like look at what exactly these advantages are? I mean, we've got, we've got some crew quarters, we've got some of this. We, I mean, we can't board the ship. Like, is our advantage that we should ram it? I feel like that's probably not ramming speed. Okay, that didn't, that didn't work. All right, can, can we ram this thing? I feel like that's the only, oh God. All right, let's uh, let's try something here. There we go. There we go. Okay, we 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 have them. All right. So if if we keep ramming the ship, we might be able to pull something off here. Like we we we're basically hooked on him. So if we go down, he goes down. Of course. All right. Oh no, 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 no. That's that's not what I want. Hit, hit. Yes, ramming speed. Ramming speed. Hit hit this guy. Come on. There we go. We've turned around. Okay, now now we've got something going. Here. Oh, that well, we sort of had something going there. Come on. Ram him. Ram him. Yes. Success. It's all we've got going. Ra ram them again. Aha! Ram that fool! Oh, the humanity! Oh. Oh, we took his ship down. Alright. Now we just need to, like, rotate out of his field of fire. Beautiful. Oh, and... This thing is still independently flying somehow. I don't I don't know how, but it is. Doesn't make any sense to me. It was the perfect plan until this happened. Stupid ship. All right, let's uh Come on, ram it. Ram it. Can I like drag it into the ground? Yes. Aha! Success! We have no guns left, do we? Oh dear. Wait, force the grounding. All right, this is this is our only hope. Okay, so we go up. Oh, we won! Yay, victory! <laughs> oh boy. We'll do one more. Assault on Fruchtenbach Castle. Your glorious missile-equipped armada is about to encounter the cannon-equipped forces of Fruchtenbach. Who will prevail? Okay. Uh... Which one of you is my ship? Wait, are you both my ships? You are. You are, in fact, both my ships. Okay. I want you to go up here. I don't want them... Oh, dear. And you can, uh, move ever so slightly down here. Oh god. I've doomed us all. We have no boarding party. Okay. This thing can move and flip over here. We gotta take out the enemy ship here. Oh dear. You know, let's uh, let's try to get our armada out here. This thing is just gonna. This thing's like got no fire left, so go for a suicide run, man. I mean, every mission with Captain Gaslight is a suicide mission, but you know, let's. Uh... I don't know. I want you to. I want you to move over here. Oh, stupid. Okay. Ram this fool! Ramming speed! Oh. 
Oh, have you, uh... Alright. Well, I can flip you over here, so at least you don't get completely murder-boned. Come on, come on. Beautiful, beautiful. You're not getting out of this, are you? Can I ram this guy? This ship's not gonna survive. I've already decided that much. Beautiful. This thing's got nothing left. Oh, down she goes! Um... What of you am I controlling now? Alright. Alright. Oh, this guy can move, so let's get him... No, he can't. Never mind. Alright, let's ramming speed into this thing. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, like, we, we've got this guy under control. This thing has gone down in a blaze of glory. I can, don't suppose I can tell this ship, this, the guy is here to abandon ship, can I? Yeah, oh, I can. Good. wonder if they'll attempt to eva invade the, uh... Alright. So we've got this thing under control. We can't really hit it from here, unfortunately. Alright, so th th this thing has been abandoned. Kinda wish our crew would attempt to invade that. That'd make my life easier. We are burning down this, very slowly. It's all going according to plan. If I can, uh... Let let's try moving in such a fashion as to, um... So we can, like, missile this thing to death. Not gonna happen, is it? Not unless this thing dives for us. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We could force a grounding and that might, uh... There we go. Yeah, we'll, we'll drive it into the ground. Oh. No, no, no. Force the grounding. Force the grounding. Ground this son of a bitch. Come on. Down you go. Oh, oh, oh. All right, let's ram this thing down. All right, that didn't it didn't quite work the way I had hoped. All right. Okay, are, are we we're not just stuck, are we? We might just be stuck. Oh, the smoke. All right. Oh, nope, not happening. Come on, drive him down. We're stuck on this thing. Of course, I wonder if I if I just flip the ship. There we go. There we go. Now we can just blow his bottom out. Nicely done. Force a gra- Oh god, now we're on fire. Oh no, he's escaping! That is considerably less good. Though this is sort of falling. Alright. Can we, uh... Where's this guy going? If we can ram into him. Come on! Booyah! Alright, yeah, we have successfully locked onto this guy's buttocks. And now we're gonna shoot him down. Possibly. Oh, this is looking horrible from the... Oh god! Let's, uh... Okay, let's get up. Down! Down! There we go! Oh, the humanity! Oh, my guns have blown up. Oh wait, no they haven't. We still have some guns here. Alright. I mean, there's not really much they can do to us at this point, so... It's basically just shooting them until they die. Classic. Classic. For the Empire, indeed. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Alright. That was good. That was good. Alright, so that's where we're gonna wrap things up for now. But yeah, alright. I could see myself playing more of this if you guys are interested. And of course, we could also blow some uh, more stuff up, build our own ships, etc, etc. But for now, that's it for this episode. So until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking and I will see all you in the next video.